Would you welcome first into the blue corner a representing Cleveland kickboxing Stephen Raybould? to get round the stylish skills of George Hennon. Let's hope it's as good as the first fight. That's all we can ask for. Hennon came forward nicely. Good combination there. Skips away from the reply by Raybould. too close to work clean at the moment the two of them nice shots from both men good superman punch from Raybould there and Hen in the left hand beautiful hook great timing right round ice kick Raybould just be warned about holding the leg and away they go again front push kick from Raybould Hennon looking to counter it this time. Raybould looking to keep centre ring. A nice turn by Hennon and a beautiful right hand on the end of that turn. Key punch of the first round so far. Sharp again, Hennon. Nice reply. Roundhouse for roundhouse. And again, a short right hand this time from Hennon again. to the front kick, oh the front push kick to the face from Hennon on Raybould oh Superman punch lands from Raybould right at the end of the round, good opener and just shading with the red second round round two two of a potential five good short left hand and right roundhouse from Raybould pushing Hennon back into his corner, nice front push kick Raybould looking to work more here in the second round. Good body shot as well. Front push kick attempt by Raybould again. Comes forward with the Superman punch. Better start to the second round from Raybould. And again, the front push kick lands. And again, keeping Hennon away with that front push kick. And the roundhouse lands from Raybould. Good opening to the second round from the 
the blue corner and a nice right hand lands as well right to the body then the big right the first one of the round from Hennon and a good front push kick again from Raybould oh spin kick negated by the walking forward by Hennon saw it coming walked into it negates it nice round house from Hennon this time left hand lands from Raybould far more accurate this second round I've got him shading it so far and a good shot to the body as well at the moment Raybould is beginning to get through and the way they go again nice left hand just clips Hen in the game but Raybould is getting through this round oh front push kick to the face from Raybould did well again there and then hits the body takes a short right coming in but it's only the second punch that Hennon has landed in this round. It's been Raybold for me. <laughs> Spinning hook kick from Hennon, but he hit the floor as he did it. Raybold shrugs it off, and a good front push kick again from Raybold. For me, that was a blue round equaling this fight up. Did all the work. Second round. So after two rounds, I've got them one apiece. It's only an informed opinion. It's not a fact. That's the judges to decide. And a very even start in this third. Left hand clips Hennon. And the left hand has a Raybould replied with the right hand of Hennon. Good front push kick again from Raybould. His kicks got better as the fight went on. And that front push kick has really started to work for him in the second and third round. Nice roundhouse reply from both men. And then they tie up. And they look to break three. Axe kick from Raybould. Just lands on the shoulder. Nice stiff jab from Hennon. And as attempt misses from Raybould. Front push kick, then the right hand from Raybould. Left hand misses from Hennon. They both land tip for tap. Very even third round at the moment. Fain, the front push kick of Raybould. Very effective, two in a row there. Hennon skips under the right hand but can't do his own work. Round as kick blocked on the gloves, but a good front push kick this time from Hennon. And again. Good combination kicking from Raybo. Just misses, telegraphed that right hand. And then made a miss, but he needs to punish him. Good front push kick again from Raybo. It's been very effective for him in this round. And away they go again. And again, short little right hand from Raybo. It's the little subtle things that he's doing in this round that I think are winning it. So he's gone from being one round down on my book to two rounds up if we go to the end of this third without anything big from Hennon. I've got third round to the blue. Second out. Round four. And again, Ray Bolt opens the round with a front push kick to keep Hennon away. Hennon's been given a real G up in his corner by Colin Payne because he knows how to judge a fight and he'll be worried about the way Ray Bolt has come back into this especially with the legs this is better from Hennon he's the one throwing out the front kick now axe kick again lands from Raybolt and a good right hand and a good front push kick again and the right hand lands from Raybolt again Raybolt growing in confidence here a bit ragged with those left and rights but a little short uppercut from Raybolt nice right hand in reply from Hennon First good right hand of the round from Hennon. And again, that front push kick of Raybould causing all sorts of troubles for Hennon. Warned about the height of that roundhouse, Raybould. And they come together again. Good front push kick again from Raybould. It's been the key to his turning around this fight. And again, short right hand from Raybould.
Hennan ducks under that shot, but he's got to start throwing counters. Make your man miss, then punish him. It's not happening at the moment. And Raybold, that front kick is just coming out regularly like a piston. And it could be getting him a big score. Good stiff left this time from Hennan. But that front push kick constantly comes out. And a short left hand from Raybold there. Good body shot from Raybold as well there to the body of Hennan. And that front push kick, it goes home again. Hennan has got to work his way around it. Oh, uppercut attempt from Raybold just misses. And I say a good round for the blue. So, I feel George Hennan needs a huge round here because Raybold is stuck behind that front kick and had huge success with it. And again. And again, that front push kick like a piston from Raybold. Comes in too close in the hole. And again, the front push kick turns out left and right this time from Raybold and a good left hand from the blue corner. Right to the body, then the front push kick to the face. Uppercut left hand from the champ from Raybold here. Again, that front kick has been a winner from oh, and a big, big body shot and left hand. Strong finish so far from the blue corner. Raybold again, the man pushing the pace. Hennan needs a big, big round here, and it's not happening. A roundhouse again from Raybold. Nice right hand attempt from Hennan, but doesn't land cleanly. Raybold pushing forward again. Hennan ducks, but almost into an uppercut there. It's Raybold throwing the shots, left, right, and a left roundhouse. 30 seconds left, and for me, these are hard times for George Hennan. The game, the uppercut lands from Raybold. Nothing coming back from George Hennan at the moment. I've seen far better performances from this young man, I've got to be honest, but Stephen Raybould has stuck to a very good game plan behind that hurtful front push kick. And again, a short left right hand from Raybould and a beautiful roundhouse, finishing strongly. And again, the front push kick left and right and Hennan not coming back with anything. Big right hand from Raybould. Finishing strongly here, right to the body as well. Big round for Raybold, and I think he's taken this four rounds for one on my card. Ladies and gentlemen, our final fight of the evening did not disappoint. Another cracking title fight. Please, let's hear it for both young men. Another supreme performance that will see a great line of kickboxing here. We do have a unanimous decision and our new IKF British Junior Featherweight Champion is from the Blue Corner, Stephen Raybould!